Hello, this time, we will make a simple sound visualizer using the Niagara module. Calzone. First, we create a Niagara system by adding a fountain emitter. Next, in Properties, set the SIM target to GPU so it can generate a lot of particles. Then set a large value for the spawn rate. And in Initialize Particle, Reduce the size of the sprite. Next, after setting the model to torus in shape location, set the radius of torus as in the video. And by changing the distribution mode to direct, the position of the particle rotates around the place where torus is located. Next, in add velocity, change the mode to from point to make the particles spread out from the position. Remove gravity by removing gravity force and set the drag value to increase the resistance of particle movement. Next, select new scratch pad module to create a scratch module. Create new audio spectrum, which is an input variable that can call audio spectrum in MapGet. Then, we create an audio spectrum module that can analyze audio data and connect it to the variable allows each particle to receive as a normalized value from 0 to 1 in the audio spectrum. Next, create an input variable of type float that can adjust the intensity of the spectrum and give it a name. Next, while holding down the keyboard M, create a multiply node and connect it to audio spectrum. Next, we bring velocity that can adjust the velocity of the particle to map get, and connect it to the multiply node to make the spectrum affect the speed of the particle. Next, add one more pin in the multiply node and connect the float variable we created earlier to it. Now, we can use this variable to adjust the particle's movement. Finally, we connect the result to the velocity of the map set so that it can be applied to the velocity of the particle. Next, create a scale sprite size. Set the curve like the video so that the particles become smaller and smaller. Next, in scale color, set scale RGB to linear color and apply a curve to make the particles change to the set colors over time. Then set the curl noise force to make the particles move irregularly. Next, set the vortex force to give it a bit of a whirl in motion. After setting variables in the last created scratch module, save and return to the content drawer. Now place the Niagara you just created into your level and play the imported song. To import songs into project, you need to change the file format to WAV. As the song plays, Niagara responds to the song's style.